Now, the next movie um, is, well, after watching it, it's really gobsmacking to think that this was held up because they couldn't find the right lead actress and they were going to go with Julia Roberts. And it's all about a black slave in real life. I don't know where we can go with this. It's just, um, she passed on it, thank you. For and we had this wonderful Cynthia en Enrivo. Um, I apologise, young lady, if I've got your name wrong. Or I don't pronounce it right. But she's wonderful. She plays it really well. And it is a low-budget movie. It's not the 12 Years a Slave, £200 million budget type thing. Look, big stars. But this young lady carries it. Where I said about Kira Knightley couldn't carry a film that was it was just as gripping this young lady carries the film and i'm really chuffed that she got an oscar nod i don't think she's going to win it as i said before one of the most sublime performances ever was from Renny zegawella for um judy but in this film you get back to seeing why the south was now trying to be get its get its way back into american history and they're going for all the Confederacy and all of that. And you realise where all this hatred comes from. And you realise how appalling it was only a hundred years ago, less than that in places, where slavery was still being used, although it wasn't under the guise of slavery. And this young lady helps loads of people who spends her life trying to help people escape down the um, telegraph line, so to speak, as they called it, where she's taken them from the deep south, she escaped herself, ran 100 miles. It's a true story. It's truly worth watching. And I, I really did enjoy it. I think definitely 8 out of 10, because Cynthia, you were wonderful. And it was so lovely to see that uh, a black actress is being nominated, and you deserve it. And I think everyone should get behind and at least watch the film and educate yourself again and then to be entertained and just realised with a bit more of a budget, this could have been a massive blockbuster. It was just the budget wasn't there for it. But I did enjoy, so thank you very much. There's not much time. You got to be miles away from here for dawn. Where is she? Follow that north star. If there are no stars, just follow the river. Listen for them. Fear. Is your enemy. Whoa. Easy now. I'm gonna be free or die. I don't know if you know how extraordinary this is, but you have made it 100 miles to freedom all by yourself. Would you like to pick a new name to mark your freedom? Harriet Tubman. You are welcome here anytime. If I'm free, my family should be too. I made up my mind, I'm going back. You're confident, composed, when trouble comes. You'll be ready. Papers. It says here you're five and a half feet tall. You ain't more than five feet. Must have won my high boots that day. Why are you back here? It ain't safe. I come to get you. Bring all of you to freedom. Do you know what would happen if you got caught? You got lucky, Harriet. I made a diss for all my own, so don't you tell me what I can't do. Harriet, welcome to the Underground Railroad. Everybody everywhere is looking for you. God don't mean people to own people. I'm sorry, I'm Find this thief and burn her at the stake. Harry! I will give every last drop of blood in my veins until this monster called slavery is dead. Yeah!